Brittany, I understand that you and five of your colleagues are involved in youth parliament. Yeah, so this year at Kyber P12 College are sending a team to um, Youth Parliament Victoria. So we're going down to Melbourne over the winter holiday and we are getting to propose a bill in Parliament. Our bill is about regulating farm gate dairy prices. So we're trying to set a minimum for farmers to be paid. This makes sure that farmers aren't getting underpaid and that our region and the, I guess, the everything that is important to our region stays important and it keeps everything sustainable for the future. Hmm. I understand you've had some training for the, um, for the debating and the presentation of the bill? Yeah, so in the past last weekend on the 30th of May to the 2nd of June, our team travelled to Melbourne and joined 120 other youth, 19 other youth parliament teams in preparing our bill. So we learned how to speak in parliament adequate, what to wear, all those kind of things. It was a really interesting weekend. A recreational camp and we formed lots of friendships and bonds. Mm, good. And um, I understand that over the years there's been a number of um, uh, youth parliament ideas that have been actually t taken up by the actual parliament. Yeah, so out of the 27 years youth parliament has been running, 25 bills have been passed into legislation in Victoria. These are like the no glass and um, nightclubs, which make sure that everything is plastic so no one gets injured from that the plastic bag levy and no overloading in P-plated cars, which is really interesting and we hope our bill passes and becomes legislation.